Hey everybody, it's Luke over at Galaxy Tech Review, and today I'm going to show you guys how to hard reset your Note 8. Uh, you can do this if you have access to the screen, or if you don't have access to the screen. I'm going to show you both methods. Uh, this is useful if you want to uh, reset your phone to sell it somewhere, or if it's not performing correctly. Now, you can go into settings and just search, and you can just type in reset. Uh, that's the easiest way to find it, and it's going to be in uh, general management or uh, factory data reset, as you'll see uh, under general management reset. So we're just going to click on a factory data reset. And now this, of course, is if you actually have all uh, access to your phone. Now, say it's unresponsive. We'll go over that in just a second. Obviously, you'll just hit reset here, and what it'll do is it will factory reset your phone. You'll lose all of your accounts. Uh, it'll ask you for your current password, and you'll be able to reset it that way. Now, that's fine and dandy if your phone is responsive and you can actually get into it. Now, say you lost your uh, password or your PIN code or you forgot it, and you can't get into your phone. What we're going to do is do this by hardware buttons, and this is going to be so that you can reset it uh, in case you forget your PIN code or your passcode. Uh, this is very simple as well. It's just a combination of buttons to press uh, to get into the recovery. So you're going to want to hold down your power button, which is on the right-hand side, the Bixby button uh, on the left-hand side at the bottom, and your volume up button as well. So you're going to want your Bixby volume up and your power button all at once. You're going to want to hold that down. And what's going to happen is it's going to boot up and it's going to come up with a screen uh, that will allow you uh, to get into uh, the recovery. Uh, now this is going to say installing system update and what it's going to do is it's going to stop for a second and say no command and do not worry about that. That is totally fine when you get no command. Uh, that'll be up on the screen here for about 15 to 20 seconds. So we'll speed this up real quickly so you don't have to watch the entire thing. Uh, what's going to happen is this screen is going to pop up and this is uh, your recovery screen and it will allow you to use hardware buttons to uh, navigate through uh, the system here. And you can use your volume up and volume down keys. Uh, you can either reboot your system now, you can reboot into bootloader, uh, apply updates from ADB, apply updates from SD card slot, or wipe data and factory reset. Now this is the one that's going to factory reset your phone and set it back from out of the box. This is the one you're gonna want. You can also wipe your cache partition, uh, mount system, view uh, recovery logs, and a few other things, but we're gonna be focused on wiping data and factory reset. Uh, you're gonna use your power button to select it. Uh, it does say uh, if your phone is reset, you'll lose all your information, so make sure to back it up first. So we're gonna press uh, the power button and then of course down to yes. Uh, this cannot be undone so you're going to want to go through that check. Just hit your power button again. You're going to see at the bottom that it is wiping out the data. Uh, you can see that uh, it is now complete the data wipe. So it had formatted data and uh, the cache and you are now set up uh, with a totally reset note 8. Uh, you're going to want to just click the power button again to reboot the system and now it will go through its rebooting process here and this takes of course a little bit of time which I'll speed up uh, so that you guys can see but now you are totally factory reset. So again this hardware method is the best method to use when you forget your passcode or uh, something in the system makes the screen unresponsive. You can see right now we're going to be at the main screen here starting Android. So we are back again uh, to a fresh brand new install of Android. I hope this helped you guys out both ways to factory reset your Samsung Galaxy Note 8. Uh, this was Luke from Galaxy Tech Review. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them in the comment section below, and I'll get back to you as soon as possible. Remember to like, and if you haven't subscribed yet, please do so, because that always helps me out, and I'll check you guys out on the next video.